he, he's been hitting the ball. Like I said, he's hit the ball hard. Um, you know, for him to uh, hit a home run to put us up top, it's a great feeling, not just for him, but for, for the team. So, um, yeah, but he's, I, I keep telling him, hey, you can't control where the ball goes. You just get, get a good swing off and um, try to hit the ball hard. And he's been doing that. You know? So, you know, hopefully that, that opens up the floodgates. He starts getting some hits and some show for it. I know he's someone who likes to see pitches. Um, for him to connect on the first pitch right down the middle, what does that say about him? Yeah, he, he was, we talked to him about being more aggressive today. As you can see, he was swinging a lot more pitches today. So uh, we want him to swing the bat. You know, I mean, hey, look, swing good pitches. You, if you get walked, you get walked. Uh, but we want him to swing the bat today. Uh, he had a good day today. What do you know about James that allows him to come through in a high-pressure situation like that? Like I said before, he's got his heartbeat. Yeah, he's got no heartbeat. He just goes out there and competes. I mean, um, I know he's been frustrated because he you know, hasn't gotten the hits he wants, but... I know he could hit. You know, we all know he can, he can hit. So he, uh, today was a good day. You know, not for him, but for the Nats. You mentioned being wanting to be more aggressive. Is that a reflection of the way pitchers have been getting him out late in counts? And, that's yeah, it's, you know, and I say this all the time. It, it's really difficult to hit in the major leagues. It's really, really hard to hit with two strikes all the time. You know, so I, you know, my suggestion to him was just go go up there, get a good pitch you can hit. You know, and let her go. I mean, don't don't put yourself in a hole by taking strikes. Uh, be aggressive, and uh, you know, but get the ball in the zone. He did that today. No, he hasn't been up all that long. But do you see any major differences, or even small ones, between the James you saw on day one versus the one you see now? No, he's been the, he's been the same guy. You know, and it's going to take. I said this before. You know, look, teams come in, they got a game plan. You know, they they, they find your weaknesses. He's going around, you know, try to just making adjustments as he goes along. But he, you talk to him, he's really smart, understands what he wants to do. And, and, um, and today shows, I mean, he stayed on a, on a pretty good fastball. that was up in his own. I hit the ball the other way really hard. I mean, I think it was 106 miles an hour. But um, he could do that, you know. So, you know, I mean, you know, when he goes up there, I feel like every time he goes up there, he's going to hit the ball hard. How would you describe his coachability that leads him to big moments like this? Oh, no, he, look, he, he, he wants to learn. You know, he, he listens, and um, like I said, you know, writing, writing his name in the lineup makes me feel good. And, uh, and I know that, you know, like when he gets up there, he's going to you know, do everything he can, hit the ball hard. Uh, I know he's going to run the bases hard. Um, he does all the little things we ask him to do. He's going to get better playing left field, um, and he's been better. So, you know, we're just going to continue to work with him. Um, and like I said, you know, with him here, our future future is looking good. For power, the opposite way. Oh, he's, yeah, we've seen him do that a lot. You know, so I mean, um, I, I love the fact that he stays on the ball really well. You know, the 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 pull, the pull side power is there also, and he'll start doing that. But the way they're pitching him right now is, you know, we want him to stay on the, on the ball. You mentioned this morning you thought that a little extra rest would be good. Uh, for Jake, that you like the position that he was in now, he got <laughs> a really good start that first inning. Is that a sign to you that, that yeah, was gonna be yeah, he was good. He was he was he was really good. Kerbo was really effective today as well. You know, so um, he was sharp. You know, he wanted to go back out there for another inning, and um, you know, seven seven innings and 100 pitches is pretty good. So uh, he did a great job. You mentioned the curveball. It seems like. Again, it was sharp, but the usage was down a tick. Is that a case of it's playing really well off the four seamer? Is that just how you saw it? Just I think it's four seamer is working really well as well. So, um, yeah, when he's attacking the strike zone, you know, and he mixes his pitches up, he's very effective. We, we saw that today. Uh, you know, he threw a couple of fastballs that you know, right over the plate, and then one breaking ball that you know that he wished he had back. Um, he didn't get it down, but other than that, he was good. For you, how much comfort level has there been knowing that when you get to the ninth inning, you don't have to think about who it's going to be, even if he's pitched the last two days, and you know you can call him and he's going to be. He's been, yeah, he's been, uh, he's been amazing. He really has. I mean, um, from from the first time that we got him to now, uh, so so much growth, and maturity, and confidence. I mean, he's got confidence now. He knows he can, he can go out there and close out games, um, and, and it takes a lot. You know, it takes a lot. We've tried many guys. It's a, di a different feeling when you're out there trying to finish a game. Um, he's got it. You know, he's he's done really well. So um, when we're getting that, you know, getting that ninth inning and, and he's available to pitch, I feel really good that you know we got a chance to win that game. How so about starting off the FPL so great, a hot series right now? Like how important is it for you guys in the team to get some momentum started going through the rest of the season? Yeah, you know, we we talked about this uh, on Friday how. This, this is this is the time now where things could go two ways, right? 
come out flat and you try to work, work your way and build your way to you know try and do something special, or we got to get out there and get 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 a good running start. Um, I'm glad the boys chose to get a good running start. I really am. But, uh, you know, that's not a bad team over there. They're really good. You know, to come out to come out and, and win, you know, and uh, beat them three games like that uh, says a lot about, you know, our boys and what they want to do. So um, we got a lot of fight, you know, and uh, I'm proud of them. Uh, we still got a long way to go. So a well-deserved day off again, and we'll come back Tuesday, and we got San Diego coming in. No. We're going to talk about it tomorrow. Yeah. We don't, we don't know what we're going to do yet, so...